And this one would turn out to be an upset of historic proportions as Allen Iverson and the Sixers were in Barcelona taking on FC Barcelona. First quarter, some great ball movement as Dennis Marconata gets free for the jam. Sixers up 22-19. Still in the first, Mihalis Kakizusu says, I'm that kid in the corner and connects on the long ball. Barcelona takes a 29-27 lead. To the second quarter, Yukis Roki Lenny handles the ball at the top of the key and drains the three as Vladi Divac looks on. The ball game was all tied at 36. Here come the Sixers. Chris Webber throws it up. Samuel D'Alembert throws it down for two of his 21, much to the delight of Chocolate Thunder, Daryl Dawkins. Still in the second, Gianluca Basili gets around the pick and hits from behind the arc. Barcelona up 50-47. to 47. At halftime, some great high-flying teamwork for the fans. To the third quarter, Chris Webber gets the ball to Kyle Korver for the lay-in and the foul. Take a look at the replay after he makes the basket. Plays a little football for the fans in Spain by using his head. Barcelona, though, still up 60-56. Then Allen Iverson hits the jumper. Barcelona's lead down to two, and Dusko Ivanovic saying, please, can we hold on to this lead? Kaki Zusus gets the ball back in the corner. He hits another long jumper, and Barcelona was up 77-75. Then Iverson brings the ball up court and fires it to Andre Iguodala for the reverse jam. It's 80-79, Sixers on top. Then Gianluca Vasili gets the ball in the right wing. He's open, and he connects from behind the arc. He was doing that the whole second half. Barcelona up 87-81. Iguodala feeds Kyle Korver, and he responds with a three of his own to cut the lead to 389-86. They call Juan Carlos Navarro the bomber, and now you know why. As he's given space, he pulls the trigger. Good decision as the bomber drops a bomb. It's 96-91. And then Yakalakovic gets it to Vasily, who pulls it in for three, gets hit on the arm, counted it goes. The dagger is a four-point play. Take a look at the replay. He knew it was good as soon as it left his hands. So did Maurice Cheeks as he hangs his head in disgust. Chris Weber and the Sixers fall to a European team, 104-99, the first NBA team to go to Europe and lose to a European team since 1987, 104-99 the final. D'Alembert, the bright spot for the Sixers with 21 points, 10 rebounds, and 7 blocked shots. The bomber, Juan Carlos Navarro, goes for 18.